Hi guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing my annual what's in my purse video. I tend to do these every single year right like in the first week of January. I don't know why I do it that way. I think it's because this is the third year in a row I've gotten a new purse around Christmas time or for Christmas. And so that kind of like motivates me to like do these kind of videos. So it's kind of a coincidence. So yeah, but for some reason I always do them like January 1st or 2nd. It just works out that way. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing a What's in My Purse 2020. I have the Gucci GG Marmont small shoulder bag crossbody situation. So um, yeah, if you guys wanna see everything that I carry in my purse with me, then just keep watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe down below and click that bell. And without further ado, let's get started. So like I said, this will be the third year in a row that I have done this video. This will be my third one, but then I also have an extra one that I did in the summer. I did a what's in my Louis Vuitton Never Full. Um, but that's like the only updated one that I've done besides the ones that I've done in January. So if you guys want me to do like more updated ones throughout the year, let me know. Cause what's in my purse like tends to change throughout, you know, like the seasons um, and stuff like that. So let me know if you guys would be interested in seeing more videos like this. But um, yeah, so the first video that I did was a what's in my purse 2018. I feel like that video kind of kickstarted my YouTube career, if you will. Before that video, I didn't even have 100 subscribers. So when I uploaded that video, I don't even know how much I got, but I got, I like surpassed 100 subscribers. So that definitely like helped kickstart my channel a lot. And then, so I was like, oh, okay, you guys like this video. So then I did it again in 2019, last year. Um, and I did a what's in my Gucci. GG Modelasse mini bag and um, that was really fun. So this will be the third year like I said and I have a different purse. I know in last year's video I had another Gucci bag and I was like in 2018 I did a what's in my Louis Vuitton. This year's a Gucci. What should next year's be? And um, I decided it's another Gucci because I love Gucci. It's my favorite designer as of right now. I love Louis Vuitton. Don't get me wrong but for some reason I'm like obsessed with Gucci. I love Gucci so, so much. So yeah, this was my Christmas present for my parents this year. It was very, very, very generous of them. I'm not trying to brag and be like, oh my gosh, I have an expensive purse. I honestly just love watching these videos and this so happens to be the purse that I'm carrying right now. So yeah, you guys seem to really, really like it in my what I got for Christmas video. I'll have that link down below if you guys want to hear me talk more about this purse, but I'm absolutely obsessed with it. It's in this beige ebony color and it's got black detailing on the sides and the back just looks like this and it's got the gold hardware which I'm obsessed with. The iconic like Gucci canvas but with the GG detail I guess. <laughs> I love this bag. You can wear it as a shoulder bag. You can wear it as a crossbody. But for the sake of this video, I'm gonna wear it as a crossbody so I can like hold it up better. But it holds a lot. This is in the small size, like I said. And it's pretty heavy because I have a lot of stuff in here. But um, I'm absolutely obsessed with this purse. This is my like dream purse as of right now. It's very unique, very me. Um, before I even asked for this for Christmas, or like mentioned it to my parents. I was researching on YouTube videos and tried to find people with this purse and I couldn't find a single person with this purse on YouTube. So I'm sure people have it, but it's new this season for either the fall, winter or spring of 2019 slash 2020. Um, can't remember, but it is new this season. So I don't think a lot of people have it yet, but it's very unique and I love it. So we're gonna go ahead and get started into the video. So it's got this flap right here and that's how you open it up. So. This is very candid, very real. I didn't organize this for you guys, obviously. Um, it, it just looks like that when you open it up. I need to like kind of declutter. I've literally had this purse for like a week and it's already really cluttered. So we're gonna go ahead and start. Um, the first thing that I have in my purse is my iPhone. This is the iPhone 11 Pro in gold. I got this for Christmas as well. Um, let me know if you guys wanna see a what's on my iPhone video. I'd be more than happy to do that for you guys. So next up right here, I have my rent for my apartment that I need to drop off by the leasing office. So that's usually not in my purse, but it is because um, I didn't have time to run it by today. All right, carrying on, I've just got 
a little pack of gum. This is just extra peppermint gum. I always have a pack of gum with me. If you know, you know. I'm just like, I always have gum with me. I don't know why, but yeah. So next I have my Gucci card holder. This is really special to me because my dad got this for me when we were in Hawaii this summer. And I just thought the pink was so different. Again, I love being different. And you know, like everybody has the black one, but I have the pink one and I don't see a lot of people with this. And it's my favorite, favorite color ever. This bubblegum pink. I just think it's so, so pretty. But um, usually I'll put some cards in the front, but they're actually in the back. But I don't want to show you because it's like my ID and stuff. Um, but yeah, I'll put some cards up front. But mainly I use this for like cash and stuff. Because um, you'll see my other wallet that's in here that I carry like my other cards in and stuff. But I love this so, so much. And I have like loose change in here as well. I have two wallets. I'm so extra. But yeah. Okay. And then also right here on top, I have this ticket. Um, this is actually for the Morgan Wallen concert that I went to in November. Um, this was obviously transferred from my old purse. I just transferred everything to this purse. Um, I haven't thrown it away yet. I don't know if I will throw it away, but um, it was Morgan Wallen, Kit Moore, Hardy, and somebody else. I can't remember, but it was a concert back in November. They're all country singers if you guys aren't from the South. Um, Morgan Wallen's my favorite country singer of all time. I'm obsessed with him. I actually saw him this summer as well, but so on Instagram he put that he was giving away concert tickets for that night and to DM him if, if anybody wanted them. So my cousin actually sent me the story that Morgan Wallen posted and he had like posted it 30 minutes ago. And my cousin was like, I DM'd him, but you should DM him too or whatever. And I was like, oh crap, like it's been up for 30 minutes. I'm sure he already gave away all 10 tickets that he was gonna give away. And so I DM'd him and Morgan Wallen DM'd me back and said that he had tickets for me that night in Fayetteville, North Carolina. So I dropped everything to go to that concert because like, what? Like Morgan Wallen DM'd me free tickets. Like, of course I'm gonna drive two hours to go see him. Hello. And it was the chillest concert I had ever been to. It was so, so cool. And just like such a cool memory. I took my cousin because he was the one who told me to DM him. So we literally just got in the car and left and headed there. And it was just a really cool memory. So I have that in here. I don't know why I went on that long tangent. Next up, this is all in the main compartment. I haven't started pulling things from the inside pocket yet, but um, okay. So I just have this hand lotion because it's winter and my hands get really, really dry in the winter, obviously like most people's, I guess. And then I'll just go ahead and pull out my keys. So these are my keys. I'm so tired of them. I'm getting rid of this keychain. I just ordered a Balenciaga like wristlet thing um, last night. So I'll insert the picture right here if you guys wanna see it, but um, it's supposed to come tomorrow. So yeah, I'm getting rid of this little leopard key ring. I'm just so tired of it, so tired of it. But here are my keys. Um, this is my like main wallet. This is a Louis Vuitton key pouch. I've had this for like two or three years. I love it. It holds so, so much. It's been through a lot. It's kind of worn out a little bit, but this is like the best thing ever. I love it. And then I just have my car key on here. I have some random keychains that I'm gonna get rid of too because they're kind of like worn out. This is like a bottle opener, or a can opener. I don't even know. Yeah, okay. And then here are all my keys. I have my key to my mailbox at my apartment, my apartment like scanner key to get into my apartment, my lake house key and my parents house key. And then this is the key to my old boutique that I used to work at, but they closed down. So I need to like give this back or something because they closed down and I don't work there. So yeah, here are my keys. Next up, I've just got a few more items. So I've got some pills because I'm sick. <laughs> I've been taking medicine. Um, and then I've got my AirPods. These are just the regular AirPods. I did get the Pros on Black Friday. They weren't even on sale. I don't know why I got them on Black Friday. But I had a defective one, so I had to return it to Best Buy. And when I returned it, they were currently sold out of the AirPod Pros and they couldn't even order them for me. I just haven't gotten around to getting more yet. I don't even know if they have them in stock yet. I need to check on that. But yeah, I'm going to get the Pros again. But um, I had to resort back to my OG AirPods because my AirPod Pros broke, but those are such good headphones. I like them. I like them a lot better than the regular ones, but I haven't even started back school yet, so I don't even use AirPods that much unless I'm in school. And then two more things in the main compartment. I've got a hand sanitizer because it's flu season. And then last thing in this main compartment of my bag, I have this Chance Chanel perfume. This is the Eau Tendre. I don't know how to pronounce it. Utendre de Toilette. I used the um, perfume one 
not the toilet. I like the perfume one better, but they only had the travel size and the toilet, which I'm fine with. But this is my all time favorite perfume. Mm, this is like the best perfume ever and it came in this little travel size thing So I just thought that was really really cool to have in my purse to freshen up Because I was carrying my big chance Chanel perfume around. I was taking it to my parents house I was putting it in my purse. I was taking it everywhere with me So I just decided to get a travel size So that's all that's in the main compartment and now for this little inside pocket. I just have a few random items Um, I got this band-aid literally a single band-aid one one band-aid because you never know if you're gonna get a blister or even if a friend gets like a cut or something. Um, I just have one band-aid, that way I can give it to them or I can use it. And then when I get back home, I can just replenish it and put a new one in. So, got a band-aid. I've just got a few lip products. I'll go through those really quickly. So I've got this Dior Lip Maximizer. I love this lip gloss, it's so pretty. I've got this Gucci Lip Balm in the shade No More Orchids, it's so bougie so pretty it's like a great lip balm it's really heavy and like so pretty it even says like gucci on the top so extra but i love it and then i've got this mario badescu lip balm and then a few more things in this inside pocket i have this sharpie pen because you never know when you're gonna need a pen if you have to write a check or you're writing something down you never know so i just have a pen with me and then i've got this eyelash spoolie because i get my eyelashes done I get extensions so I never know when I need to like comb them out or whatever but I have it in this plastic bag um I don't know why and then last thing that's in my purse is this tied to go stick because I'm very extra you never know when you're gonna get a stain on you so got this all right guys that is everything that's in my purse um I'll just give you guys like a little overview of what it looks like empty it's got a lot of room and honestly I could probably fit a little bit more in here it was pretty packed, but I still had a little bit more room. And it definitely has a lot more room than my mini bag that I have. I still love my mini Gucci bag. And there's times when I do just want a mini bag, but I needed a little bit extra space for everyday use. So I decided to upgrade to the small and I'm really, really happy with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what's in my purse. Let me know in the comments down below your guys' purse essentials because I would love to hear it. Um, it'd give me more ideas because I'm sure I'm missing something. I need to put Advil in here. Usually I carry Advil, but I totally forgot. So that's another purse essential of mine is Advil. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you guys are new here. Also click that bell so you get notified to upload every Sunday and Wednesday. Don't forget to follow me on all my social medias, which are on the screen right here and i've currently got a few giveaways going on so i'll have them linked in the description box so you guys can go enter those if you would like and yeah i love you guys so so much and i will hopefully see you very soon in my next video Mwah. bye guys